Compline begins on page 320. Almighty God, grant us a quiet night and peace at the last. Amen. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to sing praise to your name, O Most High, to herald your love in the morning, your truth at the close of the day. We sing together hymn 565. All praise to thee, my God, this night, for all the blessings of the light. Keep me, O oh, keep me, King of kings, beneath thy own almighty wings. Forgive me, Lord, for thy dear Son, the ill that I this day have done, that with the world, myself, and thee, I ere I sleep, at peace may be. Teach me to live that I may dread the grave as little as my bed. Teach me to die that so I may rise glorious at the awesome day. Oh, may my soul in thee repose and may sweet sleep my eyelids close, sleep that shall me more vigorous make to serve my God when I awake. Praise God from whom all blessings flow, praise God all creatures here below, praise God above ye heavenly host, Praise Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Please be seated. Let us confess our sin in the presence of God and of one another. Holy and gracious God, I confess that I have sinned against you this day. Some of my sin I know, the thoughts and words and deeds of which I am ashamed, but some is known only to you. In the name of Jesus Christ, I ask forgiveness. Deliver and restore me that I may rest in peace. By the mercy of God, we are united with Jesus Christ in whom we are forgiven. We rest now in the peace of Christ and rise in the morning to serve. Our psalm for the evening is Psalm 91. Da, 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 da. You who dwell in the shelter of the Most High, who abide in the shadow of the Almighty, you will say to the Lord, my refuge and my stronghold, my God, in whom I put my trust. For God will rescue you from the snare of the hunter and from the deadly plague. God's wings will cover you, and you will find refuge beneath them. God's faithfulness will be your shield and defense. You shall not fear any terror in the night, nor the arrow that flies by day nor the plague that stalks in the darkness, nor the sickness that lays waste at noon. A thousand may fall at your side, and ten thousand at your right hand, but it will not come near you. You will only have to look with your eyes, and you will see the reward of the wicked. 
because you have made the Lord your refuge and the Most High your habitation. No evil will befall you, nor shall affliction come near your dwelling. For God will give the angels charge over you to guard you in all your ways. Upon their hands they will bear you up, lest you strike your foot against a stone. You will tread upon the lion, cub, and viper. You will trample down the lion and the serpent. I will deliver those who cling to me. I will uphold them because they know my name. They will call me and I will answer them. I will be with them in trouble. I will rescue and honor them. With long life will I satisfy them and show them my salvation. Sixteenth century Spanish mystic, John of the Cross, wrote, O oh, night that guided me, O oh, night more lovely than the dawn, O oh, night that joined beloved with lover, lover transformed in the beloved. A reading from Revelation. There will be no more night. The servants of God need no light of lamp or sun, for the Lord God will be their light, and they will reign forever and ever. Into your hands, O Lord, I command my spirit. Into your hands, I command my spirit. You have redeemed me, O Lord God of truth. Into your hands, I command my spirit. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands I command my spirit. Guide us, waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep we may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations, and the glory of your people, Israel. Guide us, waking, O Lord, and guard us, sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Hear my prayer, O Lord, listen to my cry. Keep me as the apple of your eye, Hide me in the shadow of your wings. In righteousness I shall see you. When I awake, your presence will give me joy. Guide us, Lord, through the dark places of our days and nights, that we may trust you when shadows overcome the light. Remind us that darkness is as light to you. Amen.
Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who work or watch or weep this night. And give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick. Give rest to the weary. Bless the dying. Soothe the suffering. Comfort the afflicted. Shield the joyous. And all for your love's sake. Amen. Gathered into one by the Holy Spirit, let us pray as Jesus taught us. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial, and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Almighty and merciful God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless, preserve, and keep us this night and forevermore. Amen. The peace of Christ be with you always.